He's Winston on New Girl. Give it up for Lamorne Morris. Yeah. Oh, yes. Now, uh, before we start here, you know, I, I got you a drink. I don't know how close to the character you are of Winston, but uh, I know you like your fruity drinks, so there you go. Uh, very Enjoy and sip on I'm that. not yeah. like, is this, is this gluten free? Uh, it's totally gluten free. <laughs> And it's alcohol free too. I'm sorry. Hey. Drink on the oh. show. It's too early to drink. <laughs> now, uh, you are not a stranger to TV. You've done tons of commercials. Uh -huh. uh, we saw you as BT host. Mm -hmm. What's it like to be on a huge hit sitcom right now? Very lucrative. No, yeah. uh, it's, uh, <laughs> it's fun. You know? I, you know, I wanted to be an actor since I was a kid. So, you know, I went through hosting and a lot of commercial acting. And so finally, you get to a place where you go, damn. You know, I'm actually doing it, you know what I mean? It's everything that I thought it would be, so, you know, it's exciting. Now, you came from the Second City troupe, didn't you? I did, I nice. did. Second City is a great place for all those who want to be, you know, comedic actors, in mm. my opinion. You should go to Second City. Now, how Make long have you been Chicago out here? First. How long have you been out in Hollywood? Uh, four years, yeah. well, four and a half years. So you're, mm. I mean, to get on a huge sit sitcom in just four years, that's yeah. every, every wannabe actor out there is like slapping you right now. Like, yeah, they, they are. so quick, they oh are. my gosh. Uh, <laughs> now. I know on the show you mentioned on pogos. Mm -hmm. Now pogos is where you talk about your roommates behind their back. Yes. What's your real life pogo? My real, my real life. What, what people uh -huh. talk about yes. me behind what my back. Yes. What do you think people say about uh, you behind your back? I, I walk with a slight. Uh, I, I have terrible posture. No. Oh. And I'm, I've been working on it. Oh, and really? so and I didn't know I didn't realize my mom. You know she's very critical. She used to always say straighten your back. And I always thought you're just being a mom. Yeah. You know what I mean. And so when as I got older, I, a friend named Roxy. Um, she told me one day, um, like I'm walking down the street and she goes, Lamorne. I'm like, I'm way, I'm like a far distance away and I get closer to her. I'm like, how do, did you possibly know that was me? And she goes, everybody knows it's you when you're walking because you walk like that. And so, and I thought, I was just like, holy S word. Like, this is terrible. <laughs> You know, so I have to straighten my back. So. Can you demonstrate the walk for us, though? We need that so we know who you are from behind. So if you see me, uh -huh. this is, this is, <laughs> that's how I walk. That's honestly how now I walk. I feel like I have to sit up so straight right now during this yeah. interview. It's true. I have the worst posture, too. Uh, Allison Hayslip, you have any questions for Lamorne here? I'm totally, like, pinching my shoulders back now. I'm standing up straight. Uh, yeah, uh, Gerald just wants to know, uh, Lamorne, what is your favorite 80s action film? Favorite 80s action film? Uh, I would have to say, well, Lethal, Wep Lethal Weapon is great. Yeah. Um, <laughs> let's see, there's a bunch. Are you kidding me? Uh, let's see. Uh, I wish Bad Boys was in the 80s. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> um, there is an action sequence in Coming to America. Is that the 80s? Uh, <laughs> let's see. Um, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. You just like them all. I like them all. Yeah. I like them all. Uh, on yeah. the show, you create a lot of drinking games, which we enjoy. Also, mm -hmm. what kind of drinking rules would you create for YouTube watching? Uh, for YouTube watching, mm -hmm. I, every time you see a cat, perhaps in a video, yeah. <laughs> there are a lot of cats you in YouTube shot. videos. Yeah, you have to do they even a have a damn show all about cats. Now. Yes, so don't watch that more. show if you're if you're trying to stay. <laughs> mm -hmm. If you're yeah. driving, don't watch cat shows. Mm -hmm. yeah. Now uh, on your show, you uh, are uh, your boss is played by a real radio legend, mm -hmm. Phil Hendry. Yes. Now, do y'all swap stories? Does he have any amazing radio stories from back in the day? Uh, I don't remember talking about too many uh, crazy radio stories. I know he had. Damn it, you know, he did say something about, um, yeah, why am I drawing a blank? <laughs> you know, I don't, I don't remember him having any crazy radio stories. I will say this, he's a fantastic actor. Mm -hmm. And yeah. I, I, I was watching This Is 40 recently and I had no idea that he was in it. Mm -hmm. and, and I saw his character in This Is 40, I'm not sure if you've seen This Is 40, yeah. where he's driving the, uh, the Range Rover oh, yeah? and he just beats the crap out of, uh, out of um, uh, uh, what's the do? Paul he, Rudd. Yeah, Paul Rudd. I'm, I'm the worst at getting one names too. Yes, I'm the, like the worst. Yes. I'm the it worst. Just, especially when you're on live. Right exactly. Now. And you so, never get it. Allison, hey, Slip. Yeah. Any more questions here? Uh, yeah, actually, Stephanie Chandler wants to know what is your favorite color? My favorite color, red. Ooh. Although, my favorite color to wear is green. And my favorite color to look at is black. Not. <laughs> so, <laughs> any color, really. Yeah. Just any color yeah. kind of fits in there. Yeah. The sky is blue. I like looking at the sky, too, if I'm trying to be emotional. Mm -hmm. You know? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Now, uh, I know you get this question a lot, but we have to know, mm -hmm. Zoe Dash, no. Are the bangs real? The bangs are real, although yeah. her, her stand-ins bangs are clip-ons. Oh, re oh, really? <laughs> yes, yes. Her stand kind of yeah, they have to clip-on bangs for her. Yeah, I think now, it's awesome. <laughs> will Nick and Jess finally get together this season? Can you tell us this? I will say this. They, they, they you know, yeah. Oh, okay. So, yeah. I didn't say yeah. Okay. I said that, that, they will, yeah. you know. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. I'm yeah. going to take that as a guess. You heard it here right now. What's trending? Nick and Jess will. Okay. Yes. 
All right, so uh, we were inspired mm -hmm. uh, by your Trinidad Jones parody. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, Trinidad James yeah, parody. James. Mm -hmm. uh, so we picked out some other over-the-top hip-hop brags. Mm -hmm. All right, we want to hear what you think of these rappers and what okay. they're saying. Uh, we also have some of the explanations from our experts at Rap Genius if you get stuck. Okay. So are you ready to do this? Yeah, I'm ready. All right, we're going to start with a little 50 cent. Okay. All right, you a fan? Yes. Two, right. two, two quarters. All right. That's what that means. <laughs> two quarters. This is two quarters of my life. Ready? Mm -hmm. Try to dissect this for us. Okay. Sipping on some of that revenge juice, getting my taste buds ready to wolf down this spaghetti, or should I say this spaghetti even? Yeah. Yeah, he's, yeah. <laughs> you we get like, that? Yeah, I got it. You I got it. I know, I know what he's saying. He's huh? saying that he's about to, he's about to go back and get some revenge on somebody. Should he do it? Should he just chill out? Or okay. should he just fully, you know, go with his plan and, and okay. revenge on somebody? All yeah. right, that, that's good enough for me. I like yeah. that one, Allison Hayslip. All, All right. right. Yeah, I got one. Track. I got two chains. No lie. Um, mm -hmm. This is Louis V's in my archive. Black diamonds, apartheid. Bread up, my top down, on the block with a block out. Okay, so Louis V's, so he has a ton of uh, Louis Vuitton shoes. Yeah. Uh, keep, what was the other part? Uh, Louis V's in my uh, then it goes black, black diamonds, diamonds. Yeah. That's, a, that's an Africa reference. Oh, okay. All right. <laughs> I'll take it. Uh, and then bread, right. bread up, up and my top my, down. That means I got a lot of money and my cars have convertible tops. <laughs> um, <laughs> Hit the block. On the block with a block out. On the block out. with a block out. I could, you know, you know he's, he is from Atlanta. A lot of times they don't make sense. <laughs> <laughs> That's just your push. <laughs> block out could mean he on, a, he on the corner with a chick or he on the corner doing some, some illegal activity perhaps. Mm -hmm. right. Rap Genius does say, finally, he is on the block attempting to sell a brick of cocaine. Yeah. Always gets to sell <laughs> cocaine. Illegal activity. He ain't on a damn block. He just said he was in a convertible. Yeah. <laughs> you, you, you park your car on the corner and you sell that out of a convertible? That's not concealing much. Easy access? Where, where are the authorities when you need them? I know, right? Okay. <laughs> so, hey, Jay Z Otis. Mm -hmm. Photo shoot fresh, looking like wealth. I'm about, about to, to call, call the paparazzi, paparazzi on myself. myself. How white are we, by the way? Yeah. I mean, sorry, Allison. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah he, that Dissect means, that one for us. That means he's fly. He's yeah. so damn fly. He might just have to call the paparazzi. But yeah, he might have to call him on himself. Yeah. And that's how cool he is. That's Jay-Z. You got it right on the money. Yeah, you, Rap cool Genius you. agrees with you on that yeah. one. What, did they disagree with me on the other ones? Uh, Rap Genius times. don't want it with me. Rap Genius. Times. Come on. <laughs> who, who runs Rap Genius? Don't mess with Lamorne. Don't what? mess with Lamorne, Rap Genius. Come on. Allison Hayslip. OK, I got ASAP Rocky, Goldie. Mm -hmm. uh, you can call me Billy Gates, got a crib in every state, man on the moon, got a condo out in space. Yeah, that means I'm so rich that one of my apartments is in the International Space Station. Yeah. Okay, wait, that's exactly what I thought. Yeah. And Rap Genius says it's because he is high so often, the effect is like having a permanent living space on the moon. No. No, it's just that he has a lot of places, right? Let me tell you, Rap Genius, you're a stupid. Yeah. <laughs> you're one of the stupids. No, I'm kidding. Uh, no, it could mean that, but I, don't, I literally don't think that. That means no. I'm, so, I'm so fly, I'm so rich that I have a crib up there. He set it up in the beginning. Yeah, exactly. Billy Gates. It's true, yeah. I got places in every state. Yeah. There's a lot of room on the moon, mm -hmm. I have to say. All right, so Nicki Minaj, your yes. fan? Yes. Like Nicki? All right, yes. this is from The Boys. Mm -hmm. You mad dusty, you a little dusty possum. I just come through with the six like my name was Blossom. Yes. So y'all ain't ish. I'm dope. Mm -hmm. I come through with the six. It's a BMW, the six series. Okay. Oh, nice. Like, like I was Blossom. Blossom's best friend was named Six on wow. the show. Yes. On the money. <laughs> on the money with Rap that Genius, one. what do you got to say? Well, uh, she's, she's illiterate, so she can only count. And her highest number is up to six. <laughs> so, and she's high six times. No. <laughs> All right, right, we have one more with Allison Hayes. Okay, I got there. it. Okay, this is Rick Ross, Believe It. Oh. I don't want no beef. I may crack your taco. I'm screaming, rest in peace, Griselda Blanco. <laughs> oh, that's a scary name. Is Roselle de Blanco dead? She is. I there think you officially said Hint, yeah. yes. There we go. Dead. I will kill. The taco is a reference. I don't want beef, meat, also strife, disagreement. I don't want that. I will crack your taco. Head, perhaps. <laughs> or if you're like me and you have chest hair, we call that taco meat. I will crack your chest hair? No, no, <laughs> no, no, no. Really? That's taco meat? Rick Ross, I mean, you know, I love him to death, but honestly, 
What? Yeah. <laughs> they were saying that if you put too much beef into your taco shell, it will crack. And okay. so the idea, yeah. But then Griselda Blanco was a drug lord for the Medellin cartel before she was gunned down and killed in September of 2012. Oh man, rest that's a peace. Wikipedia fact, apparently. I have no comment on that. No. I'm so afraid of the cartel. I watched Breaking Bad, and Zip I tell you what, I, I saw End of Watch, and if you are Hispanic, I've got no beef with you. Mm -hmm. Are you seeing that documentary, Cocaine Cowboys? No, I, well, I didn't you see do, the, what whoa. documentary. Don't do that. that I didn't see the nothing. Crap out of you. I didn't see nothing. All right, <laughs> Lamorne Morris, everybody. Yeah. Check out an all-new New Girl tonight and every Tuesday at 9 p.m. 8 Central on Fox. And keep up with Lamorne on Twitter at Lamorne Morse. Yeah.